Welcome to our daily devotional series, The Daily Herald. I pray that these messages will come to you as an encouragement and a reminder to be heralds of the Lord daily. God bless you. Essentials of Salvation September 10 For ye were sometimes darkness, but now are ye light in the Lord. Walk as children of light. Ephesians 5, 8 He who commanded the light to shine out of darkness sheds light into the mind of everyone who will properly behold him, loving him supremely, showing him unswerving faith and trust in him. His light shines into the chambers of the mind and into the soul temple. The heart is filled with the light of the knowledge of the glory that shines in the face of Jesus Christ. And with this light comes spiritual discernment yielding willingly to the evidence of truth and walking in the light that shines in our pathway, we receive still greater light. Through the power of the manifestation of divine glory, we constantly advance in spiritual understanding. Christ's knowledge of truth was direct, positive, without a shadow. The closer the acquaintance a man has with Jesus Christ, the more careful he will be to treat his fellow men respectfully, courteously, righteously. He has learned of Christ and he follows his example in his word and action. By faith, he is united with Christ. We are laborers together with God. 1 Corinthians chapter 3 verse 9 Christ's prayer was for unity among his followers. This unity is the evidence that is to convince the world that God sent his son to save sinners. We are to serve Christ by revealing true, pure, holy love for one another. Those who are chosen to connect with the Lord's institutions are to be devoted, self-denying, self-sacrificing men, living not to please themselves, but to please the Master. These are the men who will do honor to the Lord's institutions. A knowledge of God and of Christ is positively essential to salvation. We lose much every day that we do not learn more of the meekness and lowliness of Christ. Those who learn of Christ obtain the very highest class of education. Through faith and dependence on the saving grace of Christ, they increase in knowledge and wisdom. They love and praise the Savior. Those who are saved must in this life make it their daily business to receive grace from God, not to hoard in selfishness, but to impart for the blessing of those connected with them to aid them in obtaining an education in spiritual things.